Hey, how's it going? Welcome back to Arc Aberration. We do have us a new rock trick. This was a level 152 that I got. I was kind of worried about taking him down to get a Reaper because he has he's set up for Rockwell. He's got really high health and really high stamina. Nothing in the damage though. This guy has 20,000 health, almost 900 on his damage, and stamina is about 1,500. So we are going for our light pet. <laughs> Little dude, come here, man. That would have sucked. We are going for a Reaper today, though. So, let's head down. There's two locations. That was a horrible jump. What were you thinking? Two locations we can get him at. Hopefully, the first one, which is right down the ramp leading from base here down into the red zone. I'm really hoping that's where it'll be. But if anything, we can go to the other side of the red zone to a place called the Hall of the Reaper Queens. And there's guaranteed to be some high level ones there. So let's get our light pet on. And I've got two hazmat suits, two sets, and then I have two ascendant shields that I have a blueprint for. They're really low durability, only like 9,000. So I'm kind of worried about that. And oh my gosh, there's a Reaper there already. What level are you is a question. Level 8 you will not do. Let's kite her off the side into the river. Just to get rid of her. She went back in the ground, didn't she? So you can see when we get around him, his head feathers will stand up on end. So it's kind of a way to know if one's around without bringing it out of the ground right away. Come up here, dude. I know you can jump. Oh, quit hitting me with your spines, man. You get torpor from them, and they will put your pet to sleep. Or your tame, I mean. Come on, dude. Come this way. Run, run off the edge over here. Speaking of off the edge, I wonder if there's any over here. Ah, oh, there is one. Check over on that side, too. See what level this one is, and if anything, we'll kite all this stuff off. Give us a nice, clean area to work with. That's a 12. Nope, 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 nope. You can go down in the river with your buddy here. I don't think it actually followed us. head back over this way. That's a pretty good area over here because there's one of the... Oh, there's another one. There's one of those plants that will heal you. Level 8. Is that the same level 8? It is. It's not coming off the edge. I really want to get it out of here so it's out of the way. Because as you can see, man, they roam so far. like a really horrible game of hide and seek. Oh, she's coming. Nice. Okay, she's gone now. Let's continue down this way. See if there's any more. Should be our head feathers just sell up. Oh, there they go down. There's another one of the plants there. Ah, there's one. Four. Dude, why are they so low level around here? There's another one over there. We're in some cold spores. Oh my gosh, that one came flying off. All right, there's two of them there. They're both extremely low. And there's another one there. Nope, that was a rock tree. False alarm. Oh wait, there is one. 12 and a four and a two, and we are getting out of here. Oh my gosh. All right, well, I'll tell you what. I'm going to roam around a little bit. 
and try to find at least a level 120. There's actually another one right there. Dude, are they still following us? What level are you, man? I can't see with the spyglass. If you're right in front of me, that's a 40. Still too low level. All right, let me see what I can find, and then we'll come back and attempt to tame one. Well, get stabbed by one. You know what I'm saying. All right, here's a 108, and hopefully I didn't just drag it off the cliff. Which I think I did, because it just burrowed down. Oh, man, I messed up. Let's get over here on the side. Hopefully it'll come up to us up here. Oh, there's two of them. Nope. No, not today. Oh, dude, that was horrible. Well, there was a 108. <laughs> and no more, though. Oh, man, I've just been kind of running circles. It seems like if you kite them into that element river, more of them respawn without having to actually kill them. See, like, there's another one up here already. Let's see what level it is. There's a Parlovia. That's never a good thing. Come on, dude, poke your head up, man. That's a 60. Still a little bit too low level, man. That 108 would have worked if I wouldn't have accidentally run it off the side when I was trying to avoid it. All right, back on the hunt. All right, so we got us a level 96. I think that's going to be close enough. I have been running around forever, and I don't feel like spending <laughs> multiple, multiple hours on this. So, we're going to try for this one. It's kind of over in a good area. Over there is where we came down. So we're somewhat in a safe-ish area. Let's go ahead and start working on her a little bit, get her health down. We do need to get it down around 10 or under 10%, roughly around 1 to 2,000 health should be fine. And my Rock Drake's uh, Torpor has been going up, so I don't want him to fall asleep throughout all this. Tell you what, I need to change my gear out before we get too far into this because my suit was about Totally broken. 35,000 of 48. So we just need to make sure we don't kill her. Get her down as far as we can. Hop off of our rock drake, who is now on passive. And then hopefully our shield will work and shield us long enough. I got two shields, so if anything, we can equip the other one, hopefully, before she kills us. 23, getting there, getting there. Luckily, nothing else is around here. We still look to be pretty good. Seventeen. Oh man, don't throw me off too far. Ten thousand. Cool. We're almost there. Always double check, man. I don't I don't trust counting my bites. Alright, that should be good. One more. Alright. Light pet is off. There's that aura that she's got, that, that kind of pinkish color. I don't know if you can see it. Kind of glowing around her. I mean, she's ready. Just need to get that tail swipe. Oh, she threw us off. We're going to die. <gasps> we didn't die. Did she come down here? Oh, it's another one. <gasps> she got us. Dude, through all that, we still got it. Oh, we gotta get out of here. Dude, how did that even work still? 
So we got eight minutes to get the XP up for the baby so that it'll uh, get extra levels. Oh man, my rock drake's so far up here. I don't know if we're going to be able to get that many extra levels. Dude, I thought for sure we were going to die whenever we got thrown off the the, uh, the edge up there. Oh, I can see my rock drake. Come on, dude. Get your stamina back. I don't know if I die now, if I still keep the uh, Reaper inside of me or not. I don't know how that works. Come here, man. Can you come over here? Yep, I knew, knew that was going to happen. Wait, I got my glider suit on this one. I'm going so far away from my rock drake. Come here, dude. We need to get out of here, man. Thank goodness we're not too far from the exit. I mean, we only got still six minutes, so... And I can kill stuff while I'm on the rock drake, but I need to actually kill it to get the bigger XP boost. Oh, I didn't think that part through, man. Maybe we can get out of the red zone and try to start killing some stuff off. Some littler stuff. Not a reaper, which I see another one right there. Spinos would work. We're close enough out of the zone now. I just need to get some XP, period. Oh, wait, there we go. That's plus 75 levels. What? Really killing only one thing? Well that worked out. We need to get back before what was that? <gasps> Dude, a reaper followed us! We need to get back before our rock drake falls asleep. I didn't know they could come out here. Well, good thing our base is up high. Speaking of bases, oh, there it is. Hasn't spawned in yet. Hey, crab, I got a I got a friend for you. His name is Reaper. <laughs> hey, can I get unstuck, please? We ain't got time to be messing with this. Dude, I'm having issues, man. I really hate rock drakes. I need to get to the birthing chamber. Oh, I don't have stamina. Alright, can we get some stamina back, please? Just a little bit. I've got four minutes. I've got a very important date to have in four minutes. Oh, nice. Okay, cool. So, that part of this is all done. You stay there, buddy. Please don't go anywhere. Just hang tight. Still got my climate picks out. All right, so let's get some of this gear off. And might as well get all this stuff out, too. I can put all this in the rock drake. Actually, the medical brew I'll put in the preserving bin, as well as this other stuff. Yeah, I got quite a bit of it made up over here, too, just in case. And we got plenty of food in there. Let's save a little bit for ourselves. All I got left to do now is wait. We'll get in here and get set up. Uh, that will be our respawn point. Might as well name this. Cool. Should put a chair in here for the waiting period. Well, oh, my bulb dog. Yep, that would have been bad. Oh, you know what? I didn't get any of the pheromones. 
Oh, dude. We need the pheromones to be able to come in and, and claim them without him killing us. Hmm. I wonder if I'll be able to run in and do it. Oh, man. I went through this whole thing just totally backwards. Oh, mistakes have been made. Stuff has been forgotten. All right. Well, I will see you back. Oh, man. I'm starting to gain a little bit of weight. <laughs> Perfect timing for the earthquake. All right. We'll see you back in two minutes whenever it is ready to explode out of our chest. All right. The time is almost here. Oh, I forgot my spyglass and stuff. Oh, never mind. Just a spyglass. It'll be fine. Yep, it is about time. Dude, my back looks even messed up. So we need to claim it right away. Oh, there we go. Oh, man. Claim it. Claim it. Nice. Okay, so we claimed it. Oh! There we go. It's a level 171, so not too bad. Not too bad. Um, Reaper bed. Right where I expected to be. So I don't remember this part, what we have to do. Like I said, it's been a very long time. It is in there. Let's go take a look at the little guy. Safety first. I see you in there. I see my little body in there too. Oh, I needed another window right here. He's like over in the corner there. Hmm. So. I think we need to feed him still, right? Or is he going to... Well. I don't know if he'll eat off the feeding trough. He's not yet. It's not showing the thing. Hopefully he'll make it. I don't know. My, my uh, taming and breeding and hatching settings are all kind of different from vanilla, so... Not exactly sure. I can't open this door, though. That's the thing. That's the whole point of this little airlock is to keep it from him from getting out. All right. We're going to sit here for a few minutes and see what happens with him, man. So he's now a juvenile reaper. Kind of wondering if we go in there, what will happen? I don't know when he still attacks you. I just close the door, man. Oh, he's on the feeding trough now. I think he's all right now, though, right? Let's try going in. What's up, buddy? You all right? Can I get by you? You're stuck in the floor, aren't you? I figured that was going to happen. Come over here. Let's get you out of there. I'm going to need to put it on the lowest setting to get him to follow. There we go. Just wanted to get you unstuck, dude. Oh, don't glitch out. Please don't glitch out. Oh, that would be so terrible. Do not glitch out. Oh, close the door. Close the door. Close the door. Come back in. There we go. Don't kill me. Oh, please don't kill me. So he should be 100% imp- Oh, no, he's not. Oh, wait. I'll be taking those things. Thank you very much. So do they get imprinted? I don't remember. Dude, come over here, man. You're like glitching out all weird. Yeah, imprinting 0%. Once care in two minutes. Oh, man. Please want something easy. If anything, I can run over on the rock tray and grab some stuff. Alright, so he's just about ready to want care. I don't know if we can cryopod him. Somebody was telling me in the comments that if somebody has something that you don't want for like the imprint, you can just cryopod them, throw them out, and it changes it. Oh, cuddle? No problem. 33%. So that boosted it up. That was 12,000. It's now 15. Uh, damage was, I think, 300. So that went up a little bit, and movement speed went up. I don't know what stamina was or weight, but he's doing pretty well. Get a little tall for in here. All right, I'm going to sit here and try to do the next two imprints, and then we'll come back and take him for a spin, man. Dude, I'm so glad we actually got him. He's kind of an ugly color, but we can paint him, so that's not a big deal. 
dude was quite the pain, man. Old dude just about ready for imprint number two. I think we need to put him a cryopod pod regardless to get him out of here. Uh, I don't have one of those on me, so let's go ahead and try the cryopod trick. Because we need to get him out anyways. And let's take him back to base. Actually, let's... Need to get rid of this so that that thing goes away. There we go. And then I'll come back for all my stuff, I think. I don't really need... I mean... Let's take those for sure. Take a little bulb dog. Make sure he's on. I don't want no problem with any nameless. All right, dude, let's head back over to the base. I'm gonna throw him out on the roof, I think. I don't want to do it here just because I don't want anything coming for us. Well, I tell you what, I hate these rock drakes, man. <laughs> Things are so hard to fly. Four-wheel drive, right up on top. Come on, dude! This is why I like Ravagers, man. You jump on a zip line, good to go. I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. We're just... I'll see you back when I get on top of the thing, okay? Alright, let's see if he has enough room to be up here. Oh, cool. So yeah, a walk. I mean, we're up on a roof, but whatever, dude. Follow me, man. We'll go for a little stroll up here. Oh, he's gonna run off. Oh, yep, there he goes. But it does work. Gotta watch out, there was a rock drake that was down here. Awesome. All right, I'm going to sit here and let him finish, and probably when my cryo sickness goes away, I'll pick him up and throw him back up top. Just, man, there's all kinds. I mean, there's a Megalosaurus right there. Yeah. Let's go ahead and throw him in a cryopod. Earthquake. Why would there... Yep, there he is. Oh, dude. Oh, no. Get him, man. Not you. You passive. Did he, like, fall asleep? Why did he stop attacking? That's kind of weird. Man, I tell you, it's been, like, a crazy... Oh, dude! Who, who made the rat mad? Alright, everybody calm down, man. Calm down. We got an earthquake going on. We got a newborn over here. All right, we actually got him in the cryopod. Now I got to try to fly this guy back up top again, and we know how that goes. Nice, look at that, uh-huh. Right up there, no problems. The last one is a walk. Fantastic. I take it we'll be seeing you down below again. Make them laps, man. Make them laps. I went ahead and crowd potted that one rock drake. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> he got his last imprint in. Oh, dude. There's a, uh... Yep, come over here, man. Come over here. Get away from that centipede, man. Come over here. Ah, come on. It's coming for us. Oh! Oh, there's another Megalosaurus! You would think I would carry some type of, uh... Some type of weapon with me besides a pipe. Dude, he's tearing up our stuff, too. <sighs> How much time you got left? Almost, 95%. Ah, oh, man, this guy's gonna tear up my armor. Stop tearing up my stuff. I just built that. Oh, 
I just need to start carrying a shotgun, man. I mean, this is aberration. Yeah, you leave it alone too, you little light bug. How you doing, buddy? That light kind of bothering your eyes? Yeah, it happens, man. You're an ugly little thing, but you're ours. Let's see what his stats look like while he's finishing raising up. 22,000 on the health. Stamina is 1,300. Weight is 766. Damage is 371%. And movement speed, 120%. Not too bad. Turned out to be pretty decent stats, man. I'm happy with it. I can't wait to jump on them here. The only thing that sucks about them is they don't have saddles, so they don't get that armor bonus. And we definitely got to do some painting on them. Probably get them black and blue. Nice. Let's go ahead. Why does he have so many levels? Is that normal? That must be bugged. Let me relog real quick. Where is my light pet at, dude? Are you sitting on my light pet? Yeah, I don't I don't know what it is, man. It's uh nothing's changed on my settings. Dude, I need my light pet. Ugh, why'd you have to move, man? Come on. Well, at least we got our levels a little bit earlier, I guess. Let's go ahead and put some stats into them, I guess, while we're... Since we have them, we're gonna put a lot into damage. Some into health. Maybe... 40,000? I don't know about stamina and stuff. Say what, let me let let me sit here and let him heal up, and then we'll take him for a spin and see how he does. Oh man, we're only like halfway healed up and that crab's coming down here. So I'll just go ahead and call it, get him down here, take him out. So this doesn't do too much damage, the tail. I did put some points into stamina. Yeah, it turns out I had my XP boosted way up still. I forgot to change it after I got done messing with that rock trait. That's why he got so many levels right off the start. So he's doing 781 on damage. Well, I was going to put another point in to see where it goes. Let's take him for a little spin, though. He's going to take a while to finish healing up all the way. So does he take more damage if I have my life pet on? I wonder. I don't know about that. This dude's a beast, man. Oh. Should take him down in the red zone to clear it out, you know? Yeah, that doesn't do too much. You can use it to call stuff over, though. That's not too bad. And then he's got a jump that he does, too, right? Yeah, he comes pre-spring loaded. Nice. Does he take fall damage, though? I don't know. And let's see how he does, well, hmm. <laughs> I want to see how he does swimming. But at the same time, I don't want to see how he does swimming. Let's go over on this side. Maybe it'll be a little bit. Some would say for all. Oh, Silico pearls have respawned. Stay away from the jellies, man. I don't know, might not be deep enough here to swim. Dude, we can actually walk through all of this now. I see you guys over there. Oh, yeah, it drops off right there. Where are those eels at, man? I don't want to get shocked and dismounted. Oh, dude, we're way down. I just drop everything. So he's still got a ton of levels to put into him. I'll probably boost his health up as he regains more of it. And then maybe boost damage a little bit. He's, I mean, 800's pretty good on damage, really. I kind of want to see how his stamina's going to do. Because I really want to take him topside against the Reapers up there. And do some supply runs. That's one thing I really have never done is explore too much of the surface. And done supply runs. I guess I could boost his his weight up some, right? How much does that go? Uh, it only goes 30 points per. I say then we could take him up instead of the Ravager whenever we do like oil runs and stuff. Nice, man. Well, I don't think I'm going to use these on Rockwell. I was thinking about using a couple of these and some Rock Drakes mixed in against Rockwell for the beta. But, dude, the pain it is to 
to do a reaper oh you saw how much trouble we just had doing this one i mean <laughs> i technically i should have died from that fall the only thing that saved us is i boosted my health up a little bit i think whenever i got those points from beating the gamma rock well but it's been a very busy day man a lot has gone on we do got our reaper so that was successful and we'll see where we go from here hope you enjoyed the video as always thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one